Condolences from around the world of sports continue to pour into Cleveland, honoring the memory of the man who was the greatest Cleveland Indian ever, Bob Feller. Feller died last night at the age of 92. While plans for a memorial service are still in the works outside of Progressive Field, fans stopped by today to honor the man who was one of a kind. Bob Feller may be one of the few athletes of all time who in life was even larger than the statue that honors him. This afternoon, the team put together their own tribute to number 19, a man who was the Indians. It's a sad day for all of us, the city of Cleveland, the Cleveland Indians organization, all of baseball. Uh, we lost a true uh, legend, a true icon, and a true American hero uh, last night. And I think uh, it's important for all of us to reflect and, and honor him and celebrate uh, what his life meant to all of us. That's why these guys wanted to stop by and pay tribute. They may be in their 20s, but they know what they had the opportunity to see from the man who would toss out the first pitch on those opening days. This is a Cleveland sports fan. I mean... It doesn't get much bigger than Bob Feller, you know, Bob Feller, Jim Brown, those are Cleveland icons. So. They're saying, I know they didn't have radar back uh, in his day, but that story about him out throwing a you know, motorcycle going 90 or whatnot is, is something else. In an era where athlete as role model is often debated, Feller the player, patriot in person, lived his life as an example for young kids everywhere. One of the reasons I liked him so much is he is kind of a no-nonsense kind of guy, you know, he... Uh, very unselfish, especially staying with the Indians his whole career and especially serving with the, the Navy. You know, I think a lot of guys today uh, could learn a lesson from him. And that is something that we have been hearing from a lot of you today. For more on the life and legacy of Bob Feller, go to Newsnet5.com.